Hi myself Rahul me and my friend Abhishek Ranjan are going to show you a design of 5 volt power supply with over voltage protection we will be showing you simulation of design circuit using multi sim simulation package first of all how does the circuit looks so this is the circuit it consists a power supply of 230 volt a step down transformer a bridge circuit a voltage regulator ic track oscillators and this is a jener diode of uh, rating 5.1 volt now the question arises is why do we need this circuit or what is the objective of the design so i am going to give you a brief description about this circuit for circuit using ttl ic the supply voltage is a great concern and the slight increase in supply from the rated 5 volt may damage the ic using fuse alone does not solve the problem because a fuse may take several milliseconds to blow up and that's enough time for the ic to get damaged in this circuit a coverage scheme is used in which a track short circuit the power supply and burns the fuse the burning time of the fuse is not a concern because the power supply is already sorted by the track and the output voltage will be zero when the output voltage exceeds 5.1 volts the jener diode d7 conduct the switches on the direct d5 now t1 acts as a closed switch sorting the circuit now the rest of the things is explained by my friend abhishek ranjan yeah hi uh, this is abhishek as described before the circuit is being used for old over voltage protection now so the circuit mainly supplies for 5 volt uh, dc circuits now this circuit we are using to show how track switches very fast uh, how the track can be used as a very fast switches uh, actually this actually the switching time for track is in microseconds so we will be showing that mm, before that this voltage regulator ic 7805 this uh, maintains an output voltage of 5 volts for inputs uh, for input voltage range ranging from 10 volts to 35 volt or maybe uh, 100 or 200 volt as rated for the as rated by the manufacturer but uh, in practical scenario if the voltage of the input side of the 705 ic goes beyond the rated by manufacturer vo input voltage the ic gets damaged or and the output voltage uh, need not be 5 volt necessarily so uh, the output circuit gets say uh, not 5 voltage not 5 volt uh, volt uh, so in that case the load circuit connected to this power supply circuit may get damaged so uh, but if uh, here we are using an 1 amp fuse in practical cases this uh, one amp fuse will take few milliseconds to burn out but the voltage across the uh, the load circuit may for uh, if it even appears for very few milliseconds it will get damaged so the trick is we are shorting the supply as soon as the voltage at this at this junction gets more than the rated voltage that is 5 volt here and in here now uh, hmm but this in practical cases this ic may burn if the voltage of here uh, on the input side may appear more than the rated input voltage for this uh, ic but in this simulation package uh, we are not able to achieve that S it will be working as usual if even if the voltage is uh, say see here we are supplying 230 volts here but in that case also it is conducting so we will be using a very uh, little lesser 
which are in a diode here. This is directed for 4.7 volts, and this will maintain 5 volts at this end, at this point. Uh, when I go for simulation of the circuit, what will happen? The voltage at this point, at the output of the 7805 will be 5 and the voltage uh, of uh, the zener diode is 4.7 so this is this will be uh, reverse biased and it will start conducting so when this is conducting on uh, the gate uh, yeah, this this will provide a very a control over the track here this means this uh, as soon as the voltage here gets uh, 5 volt in in application cases if this is for 5.1 volts so if this in practical case if 7805 voltage regulator is damaged and this vo this voltage is more than 5.1 then this diode will conduct and which will cause this track to this uh, yeah this will activate this switch this track will conduct and what will happen you can see here that the supply voltage su the supply current is coming through this now th when this is conducting this will short the supply only so when the uh, uh, current through this uh, fuse will be 1 amps it will get burned this is going to happen in when we apply this circuit now I'm going to show you the sim simulation of the circuit Yeah, you can see the fuse burning out, and because uh, and uh, yeah, and this light goes off. This uh, this light was going, uh, uh, this light was glo uh, glowing, even uh, after few seconds after this uh, fuse went out, because these capacitors are discharging. So, and the voltage across is dropping. The voltage across this lamp is obviously dropping this uh, resistor i'm using for discharging the capacitor very quickly so you can see the fuse burning out and this light going off uh, there is no point in how long it takes uh, this lamp to go off because as soon as this uh, diode conducts this strike starts conducting and the power supply is itself shorted so the voltage at the load circuit end at this end is of is be becomes zero so this way the load circuit can be protected using the circuit that's all thank you